Hello everybody, my name is Kevin and more. welcome back to another video of Life is Strange 2. We're going to continue this series. This is a, a fun series right now we're playing, guys. I'm really enjoying it. Hope you guys are enjoying it as well. I mean, it's already much better than before the storm, that's for sure. And it's, uh, I'd say it's even, even though it's only the second uh, episode right now, half of the second episode or maybe even less, it's still it's already better than the first one which it's something by itself because the first one was pretty good right now it looks like um, both uh, both kids are, are going out we're marching on to the woods and stuff getting out of where we were previously because obviously we had to move on we didn't we were gonna run out of supplies eventually so we're just gonna move on to the city now to go for our grandparents place now obviously this is one of these moments that there should probably be some music and stuff but there's no music why because obviously i cut it off copyrights reasons and stuff so not messing with that guys It's really a shame too because Life is Strange movie, the the songs for Life is Strange are usually really good, but uh, I can't listen to them. I'm gonna have to listen to them on my own to, uh, time. I, I guess I, I didn't hear any uh, any any team so far for the, uh, this game in particular. So I don't know, guys. We'll see how it goes, really. Matching on a lot now, of course, because of the lack of music, I gotta do a lot of the monologue. So I gotta talk. <laughs> I gotta talk instead of uh, putting on some music and stuff. Which I don't know what to say really. I just want to watch, but I need to talk because obviously, the otherwise the ambience is gonna be so weird. It's gonna be so weird if I just don't talk because there's no noise too. It's really made for, this is what Life is Strange is all about. There's the music right here normally. So just imagine the music right there. With um, the kicking in and stuff for a, little, for a while there. Just kicking in while they're marching on. Because there's no, it's made exactly because of that. Uh, in that purpose where there's no noise, other noise than the music. You know, than the team. But since there's no team and stuff. Pretty no, it's pretty stupid. So, I guess we're gonna we ask around for some place. Oh, here we go. Here we are again, guys. I guess still no music. Man, I I wish I could just put the music on because now I gotta <coughs> all the way. This is a goddamn long cutscene. We made it, Danny. Oh, there we go. Finally, they talk. They do some noise. Time since I was here. When was that? Before you were born. Merry Christmas, huh? It seems it seems like we are in a uh, Christmas time. I don't know how this is gonna go though. I don't know if the grandparents are gonna be happy to say. Well, of course they're gonna happy to say see us, but I don't know if they're gonna call the cops or something. Something tells me we're not gonna. You don't want to like, look like it's not gonna go our way. Never does. All right, let's go ahead and ring to the, the bell, guys. I guess. What are you waiting for? There's nothing uh, much else we can really do. Let's see what the heck is gonna happen here. Hope something good's gonna happen because. Wait, what? Nobody's answering. What is it when on vacation? Or, uh, They're not on vacation. Something. The the lights wouldn't be. It wouldn't be on if they were in vacation, my guy. They're clearly there. They know some. They know someone's there. What are they doing? I'm sorry, we don't oh, there want we go. any of. What's up? Hello, Claire. Sean. Oh my. Is that Daniel? What's going on out here? I heard. Look who's here! After all this time. What the hell are you doing here? Stephen, watch your mouth. Well, 
We're looking for some place to stay. If you want to uh, us to stay, I guess. Oh, you poor thing. Yeah, my brother's really sick. sick, right? <sighs> yeah. I... Okay. Inside. Both of you. I don't know how this is gonna go, guys. I don't know. It feels pretty weird. Ah, I don't feel like doing. I really didn't feel like uh, doing a video right now, like a uh, Life is Strange video. I wanted to do some NHL video, but I saw that I was at uh, the point where I, I needed to do another uh, one of these uh, video, hey, another it? part for this one. So warm enough for you. I gotta do it, guys. It's not that I don't enjoy the game. I really enjoy it, but I gave Daniel it's not the confidence. game I wanted to play today. Especially since I he could have been had worse. a lot of time where uh, I barely sleep, I slept, so I can't focus right now and I can't really monologue. I can't talk a lot. I need to talk a lot for Life is Strange since there's no music and stuff. And it's, a lot of me. it's a lot for me to focus. There we go. There's some gameplay, finally. There's a long part where it's just a supposed to be music there was no noise it was pretty weird and pretty like pretty weird all right i'll drink oh, shit what i'm so hungry my belly hurts oh all right <laughs> i was like oh shit what what is it like it's, it's just a hot drink what do what you mean okay window grandparents a painting you know, I don't have really anything to say. What about the kitchen, I guess? I feel so awkward I to be... I feel like there's no point in che looking at anything, really. What about the grandparents, I guess? <sighs> Fuck. Can you stop I'm swearing? Here. Like, every second you just swear. You're just like my father, for Christ's sake. It's good to be inside. Finally. Alright. What about the painting, I guess? We got a... We gotta look at everything. Remember that. There we go. We had to look at everything in order to, I guess, get out of there or something new happens. They're probably gonna throw me out or something. Because they know they they just. You want more They probably think I'm uh that uh I'm the problem or something. Sean, you want to talk about? The police called us a few weeks ago. They're looking for you as... Yeah, I know, I know. ...in a homicide? And for assault and robbery in a gas station? Now, if you want us to help you, did you... hurt that police officer in Seattle? Uh, seriously? I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not gonna question them. I don't. I'm not gonna insult them as well. Like I'm gonna stay strict here. I don't want to be in their bad side. They just gave me the chance to be in their house. You know. He shot dead. And now he's gone. Oh, sweetie. We are so sorry for what happened to your father. But why did you run away if you're innocent? Uh, I had no choice. I freaked out. Protect Daniel. I had no choice. Um, it's either I had no choice or to protect Daniel. Uh, I freaked out. You know what? To protect Daniel, I guess. I didn't want Daniel to see Dad. Like that. I felt like I had to protect him. I understand. You know the police would separate us. Maybe forever. Yeah, we don't want that. Foster care. It's the only thing. Yeah, we don't need foster care right now. It's sure, the only thing sure. that keeps them together. Is they're together. Anyway, at least you managed to come here alive. We're glad you two are okay. Well, I'm glad you're glad. To think yes. what could have happened to both of you. We had a lot of uh, of things that happened uh, to, to us. So long-term solutions now. 
I tried. I swear. But I can't do everything. So... What are your plans? Well, down to Mexico? Figure it out? Uh, down... Why were... We, that's not a plan. Do, going down to Mexico is not a plan. That's a terrible plan. I would say go up to Canada, my god. Not down to Mexico. What are you talking about? Mexico is not a friendly place. I'm sorry, but it's true. It's not Canada. You got to, when you got an option between Canada and Mexico, you go to the latter. You don't go to the bottom. Like, come on now. You kn we all know Canada is one of the best countries in the goddamn world, and you don't want to go there. What are you crazy? Let's go figure it out. I'm trying to figure it out. I just want to watch out for Daniel. Wait for him to get better. Before we take the road again. How can you look out for your brother if you're both running from the police? You two are gonna stay with us. Oh, Stephen. Maybe we should... After your mother left, your dad never really wanted us in your life. I can't blame him. But you're still part of our family, and we want to prove it. Okay? That's cool. That's really... Not scared? F no, I'm just going to say thank you. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. That's means a lot. means a lot. I do need to know, though, if you're just going to bail me... Steven. If it's uh, that's just you bailing me out, or that's you okay. trying to we have to lay down keep the me there until you call the cops or something. No you mess, know? no noise. I can't entirely trust them. Service. The biggest rule is keep your heads low around here. Beaver Creek is small and nosy, and nosy. We can stay. Yeah, we can stay. This is awesome. Yeah. Ooh, Sean. No Guess more what? sleeping bags, There's my guy, for now. Train upstairs. Hey, you're supposed to be resting, young man. <laughs> yeah, yes he is. But he seems better already. Anyway, you and Daniel will stay here. At least until Daniel's better. We'll see what happens next. I'm agree. I, I agreed. Oh, I bet you're hungry. Oh yeah, we're very yourself. hungry, good lord. <laughs> I we we've been eating for a uh, can some food for for months now or something. It's very nice that they just welcomed us there. I didn't expect like that. Normally in life people tend to just reject you, you know? If you do something if you are like uh chased after the cops or something or uh nice for even if it's the for the wrong reason or yeah. stuff, the people don't care. They don't see it, and usually Feeling they better? just reject you. You look cozy. It looks like yeah. this family is actually a, a nice it. one. I'm not gonna trust them too much, though. Never know might, Thanks, what bro. might happen. Good. Your temperature is down. I'm way better now. You still need to take it easy. How about if we say a little prayer and, and give thanks? Why? Sean says that's bullshit. Now, boys, that's not very polite. We always say a prayer at bedtime. Always. Do we? I don't. Sorry, we never do. Well, we never do. We I'm going to be do. plank with it. I don't want to be... Like, I don't want to be... Uh, church. There we go. So... Why well, see? Maybe you're too young to know everything yet. But I can't make you pray. Well... It's time for bed. And no roughhousing in here. No worries. We're too tired. Good night. Thank you again. Yeah. We'll be quiet. Good night, Grandma. I don't want to reject them. But I don't... I, don't, I, I won't let them force us, like, to... To do a bunch of stuff that we normally don't do as well, you know? Bed again. Not going to be brainwashed, uh, too. And the bathroom. I hear that. Plus, you don't smell anymore. Whatever. Well, that prayer thing was pretty weird. 
It is what it is, man. I really hope we'll be okay here. I think so. And the more important thing is you'll have time to get better. Sean? Are we in Mom's old room? Nah, I don't think this is the one. Not from what I remember. But it's been a while. Could we check it out tomorrow? Maybe find some of her stuff? Um, I'm gonna say why. That's why I was wondering myself anyways. Why exactly do you want to go find some stuff? Daniel, I understand. But we need to focus on where we are now and where we're off to. Mom left us. She made her choice. We gotta make ours. Yes, exactly. We can't you gotta let her go, man. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, I guess. Hey, man. You've been doing so great with your... Well... You know. I was wondering... How do you do it? Uh... I don't know. I concentrate and... It just happens. Feeling strong? Does it hurt? Does it hurt, actually? I wonder if... I don't care about feeling strong. Does it actually hurt? Because Wait. there might be some side effects. Does the, it hurt? The no. sickness might be a side effect from it's that. It's kind of itchy, though. I am exhausted. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway. Remember the rules, right? We really don't want Claire or Stephen to start asking questions. Exactly. I know, I know. Number f number one rule, my guy. Don't Remember you. that one. Just keep that. Exactly. In Do not show off. You should be fine. Especially not in this house, since uh, you start showing off, they're gonna be creeped out, and they're definitely gonna call the cops on us. It's time to wake up, guys. Time to wake up. What's that, uh, what's that picture or that portrait or the poster, I guess, whatever. One week later. Good. It's already been a week, man. All right. We're staying there for a while now. More than a week at one place? That's crazy. I should get a new teacher, a t-shirt and everything. I wonder if they went out or like, do they know the place very well or how's it like going now? Let's see what we got in this room, I guess. We're gonna poke around a little bit. I could sleep all day long in this bed. But I'm way too hungry. Okay, so Van in. What is that? Wonder if Brody noticed his hula girl was missing. Okay. What about uh, this right here, the picture? That's cool. Claire dug this up for us. That's such a baller in his suit. Yeah, pretty cool. All right, well, let's see what we got. Uh, clothes, yeah, I guess we get dressed, right? Let's go get dressed right now. That's one thing that I hate in life. I always take my shower uh, after right. sleeping, guys. I'm allowed to go out now. Always, because I feel sick if, uh, if I don't just, you know, if I don't just shower and stuff. Uh, uh, earmuffs. That's ridiculous. Uh, dice. Okay. That's a cool memento of our secret cabbing in the woods. Okay. What about the other stuff? Space toy. Man, Daniel's really made this place his own, huh? It's more of his uh, room than mine. Pajamas. All right. Backpack. What about Daniel's bag? Uh, yeah, what about that? Okay, see my objectives. Go downstairs to have breakfast. Oh, that's it? Okay. So what is that exactly? What is that? Blanket? We got a blanket. We got this thing right there. A tent. Which is pretty cool. We also got uh, this. Probably the best thing we found in the whole house. Obviously, yeah. Alright. We, we got $9 still. Wonder if they could give us something, probably. Now... The thing that's gonna happen is probably eventually he's gonna not gonna show off, 
but he is by accident gonna use his powers and they're gonna freak out or something. It's probably gonna happen, guys. You already know. And uh, that's a problem, really. Okay, so what's going on here? Can I take a shower or something? Grab the bar? No, why would I? Okay, so empty glass, sink, wash the face. I might as well wash my face, I guess. Since I can't take a shower, might as well just wash my face. Oh, man. How did we survive for weeks out there with no hot water? Okay. Uh, medicine, towels. We don't have anything. Okay, let's see what we got uh, some somewhere else. I don't want to start opening doors because I don't know. I don't know if it's going to have some, like something's going to happen or something. Let's just see what we got right here. I guess we gotta st we can oh talk to him. Lord. Let's talk to Stefan, guys. <sighs> What's up? Ah, look who's here. But uh, you're too late for the 915 Express. <laughs> um, it's okay. I'll take the next one. It will leave after breakfast. Don't be late this time. <laughs> I won't. That's crazy. Uh, Daniel's having a lot of fun. You can tell that He's really happy to be there. Hold your He's really happy to be there. And I don't remember much you know this place? I came here. Actually reminds me a lot of um, the composition, the, the way it is done. If you put this instead of uh, of this right here, you actually put the garage door in there. You put the garage. It's just like the room of Chloe. It's just like uh, Chloe's uh, house. Which is crazy. Reminds me a lot of that. Steven doesn't like us in here when he's away. Okay. Alright. Um, toilets. Tunnels. Okay. So what do we got here? Got a nice TV in there. Nice sofa too. Well, I'm not sure about the colors, but it's pretty nice. When you think about it. Alright. Uh, not sure about the, the, the control though. The controller. Seems a little bit off. They have a phone like this, so they don't have cells. They don't have a cell phone. I mean, they've got nice decoration. This is a nice house, guys. Oh it's a nice house for Who's sure. Awake? Good morning, sleepyhead. It's that bad. Good morning. There you go. Feels like a cloud. <laughs> I know. Let's join for breakfast, I guess. It's the only thing. It's our main quest. There's Good nothing morning. else, really. Breakfast time. Your brother is ready. I like how the juice that we got, the orange juice, is just Steven, basically called orange juice. There's nothing else now. to it. You can show that's the, the box car later. That's the company itself, orange juice. I'm loving it. I love it. how they're getting along. So do, what do we eat today? No help. What's on the menu? Yeah. Mm, what's on the menu this morning? Well, someone told me the buttermilk waffles are back. Yo. Mm, awesome. You cr you're kidding me, right? You boys don't I love that. We had a express delivery this is going to be great. But We're having a right, like, an awesome yep. time right now. Go straight to the workshop. Good. No trains in the kitchen, remember? Gotcha, chief. Choo-choo! Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> They're having a lot of fun. I'm loving it. This is, this is real nice. This is just a simple of what Daniel and I could have... Uh, like could have gotten sugar. If it wasn't for the fact that uh, trains, but things uh, went how they went, of course. Did I make enough? Everything's okay. It's great, as usual. Carlos, well, she uh, put that off. I don't know how that happened with, this new with her life, just pulling it with her. Or stuff on but oh well I miss Seattle it's no actually it's nice yeah it's nice to be far away from everything pretty nice to finally change Feels places like the only ones out here. change sceneries well, that's exactly why we love it it feels safe unlike the big city I get it I like it it's cool here well bless your soul you'd get along good with our neighbors we try to lend a hand, 
like to Charles next door. He lost his wife. Um, things have been hard on him and his son. He would just get lost in Seattle. But we're all taking care of him here. How old is his son? I, I think he's your age. Ooh, cool. Yeah, you got ideas? You're gonna play with them already, huh? Something's gonna go bad, guys. Now imagine, I got a feeling, I got a strong feeling because it told us about the Captain uh, Spirit thing in the very beginning of the second episode. Oh, don't, stop. Stop. Stop, are you crazy? Don't do it. Hey, what's going on back there? Nothing. What the fuck are you doing, Daniel? What did I tell you? Oh. <laughs> it's been a week and already you're fucking up. There we go. Grandma, I wanted to ask you something about that locked room upstairs. I told you there is nothing to see in it, Daniel. Why were you in it this morning then? Because there's a lot of old junk in there. And besides, it's not safe for you to explore, okay? So listen to your goddamn grandmother, all right? Daniel, language. Yeah, Daniel. Why don't you go explore Come on. outside? You sure look like you're getting better. Get some fresh air. I'll wait for Sean, and then we'll go. We won't be loud. Promise. But be careful nobody sees you. Stay in the back, okay? He's probably not gonna stay in the back. He's probably gonna be a jackass, like maybe always. Maybe tell him that it was Karen's room. And maybe you should tell him to watch his mouth. Oh, I should. I, I did try, but... I, I told him once, oh, it was fine, and now he's just doing it all the time. Why lock it then? Daniel needs to know. No, why lock it then? Why lock it then? It feels like you're hiding something. There's no secret. We just want to move on with our lives, Sean. I do want to do that too. So nobody. But Daniel doesn't anything, seem okay? to think the same. I'm serious. Uh, I don't care anyway. I don't know what to say, really. Uh, yeah, actually, mom contacted you. I'm kind of... You know what? Did mom ever contact you? Did she? She only talked to dad a few times. Then she was gone. Yes, yeah, she was. You know, Sean, I don't really want to talk about this anymore. It's over. Anyway. That was a weird cut. You have to respect my rules under my roof. Okay? Uh, you know what? <laughs> I wanna... That's cause... I don't wanna tell her sh to chill out. That's not... I'm ch I tell Daniel to chill out because he's my brother. Come on now, they're offering me a, a place to stay. I'm not gonna start insulting them. What the fuck? Just say, of course. Of course. Always. I appreciate that, Sean. Now you better go find your brother. There's a shed with some old toys outside. I'll bet Stephen has the key. Danny will freak. Thank you. The, the thing is, right now we're trying to make things as as good as possible with the the ones that are treating us like are welcoming us here Stefan and uh, Claire they were kind enough to give us a home so we need to be kind enough to like we need to be kind to them in in exchange you know it's not free you kids. gotta give something in exchange Daniel's going nuts again. obviously so what do I do here Charity flyer, not really, travel picture. Yeah, I was talking about the Captain Spirit thing. And I, I've got a pretty strong feeling that the kid and the dad and all that stuff, the, the actual neighbors, are, uh, are Captain Spirit. I've got a pretty strong feeling. If that's the case, we might have something crazy going on, guys. Now, I didn't want Daniel to show up. I was rude to Daniel because I didn't have a choice. He was really, 
what did I tell him? Like, it's very dangerous. He does not... We don't want him to use his powers in front of this, uh, Stephen and Claire. That's a no-no. That's that's just the the exact thing we don't want him to do, you know? We want him to do otherwise than that. Because this is very much a danger thing. They don't know that you have powers. And they don't... If they start knowing that Daniel's got powers, guys, we're fucked. All right? We're, it's over. I'm done. So... What? What is it? It's just monologuing, my god. Just let me speak for two minutes, for Christ's sake. Titty. Alright. So what do I do here? What, what am I supposed to do here? So... Let me just check my stuff. Ask Stefan for the shed key. Oh. What about this? Whoa. Look at all these decorations. That's so cool. Okay, that's all he's got to say. All right. Oh, so are you excited about the tree? I'm gonna let her talk to Daniel. I'm gonna go uh, talk to Stefan. Ask him for the shed, uh, the key shed. Where is he at? Where is he at? Where did he go? Huh? It's not there anymore. I don't want to start. Uh... It's been locked ever since we got here. I want to start going to rooms and stuff without asking. Better not sneak in. They won't like it. This is our room? Okay. Um, I'm not trying to sneak in. I'm just trying to lean. Why would I lean? Okay. Um, Where is he? Where is he? This is our room. So he's not there, obviously. Where got where's where's Stefan? Just the deported or something? What, what what's going on here? Did he go outside? Or is he there? Oh he's right there. God damn he's got his own Think place. I need a handy assistant. All right. Can you hand me the glue in the cupboard behind me? Sure. Hold on. You got it, boss. I got you. Whoa well done now. Sorry, i I forgot. That thing isn't too stable. Let me just... Uh, okay. Sorry. My fault. Your grandmother keeps telling me, but... Uh, I'm a lazy old man. Hey, uh, can you close the door? I want to talk for a second. Oh. Uh, what is it's it? the power cable, of course. Yeah, it happens all the time. Now, you got a strong feeling, guys? Powers of Daniel? This thing that is uh, about to fall down to so, uh, listen, on anybody? Uh, Something's gonna happen here. Things with Daniel. You know what I'm talking about, don't you? Uh, no. Hide the secret, tell the truth. What? What about? What do you mean? Hide the secret? No, I don't know what you're talking about. I have no idea. Um, not really. What things? Well, I, I'm not sure how to put it. Like, some kind of invisible force. Like the holy gift or something. Um, I'm not sure what uh, you're talking about, my guy. Daniel likes to pretend he's got superpowers, but that's it. That's it? Okay. But be careful, Sean. You know, he's still so young. Sure. And by the way, let's keep this between us. Claire has a lot of strong beliefs. She wouldn't understand. She adores Daniel. And just wants both of you to be safe and happy. What I'm trying to say is... Maybe you should stay here with us. I know you boys plan to run to Mexico. But How do you know that exactly? Per Portuo, Puerto Lobos, huh? Um, I'm gonna say why not? You know why not? It seems like a nice place. We don't need to go to Mexico. It's not. It's not necessary to go to Mexico. They didn't call in the cops. We're still a week now. So I'm definitely trust them now. 
Maybe we could, but... <laughs> Why not? I know, being out here in the sticks with us old farts isn't exciting, but... This is your home now. <laughs> it's cool. Kinda different, but... I just don't want you to get into trouble because of us. It's dangerous to be on the road. Do you think your father would have wanted this for his kids? Different now. You don't know him? Well, I'm not. It's different now. Of course. But there's, I love how there's always the option of being just rude completely to them. It's different now. I know. This is not the, the Walking Dead Telltale series, guys. I'm not rude to people anymore. But it's not my character. Torture yourself. I will. Hey, uh, Claire said you had the keys for the tool shed. Oh, uh, sure. <clears throat> Here. Thank you. You guys enjoy the sun. Thank you a lot, buddy. I won't lose them. I yeah. I'm sure yeah, you I won't lose them. that shed. It's probably a mess inside. Thanks. Alrighty then, let's go to the shed, uh, shall we? It's good to let's find some kind of big toy for uh Here you are, Sean. Daniel. Hey. I have to go out and run some errands. Can you do me a big favor? Do you know how to work a washing machine? <laughs> Since I was about eight. Of course. Can you throw in yours and your brother's clothes after the next load? They're in the bathroom basket. Totally, yeah. Um, no problem. Thank you so much. <laughs> Feel free to start tidying your stuff, too. It's good for the health to keep a house clean. Definitely. Daniel can help. Ah, and remember, for your own safety, no phone and no internet. I know, I know, boring rules. Don't worry, Claire. I got you, I got you. Hey, Daniel! Alright. for you. Uh, busy doing what exactly? Yeah, busy oh. doing what? <laughs> you gotta find me first. Oh, come on, not this shit. No, I'm not playing, Daniel. You, cri you kidding me right now? Daniel seems so happy to be oh, here. Oh, God. Good. It's so dark in here. Let's just switch on the lights. So, this is our washing room. Search our closet. He's not there, obviously. Not gonna find him. You know what, guys? We're gonna keep this for next time. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you didn't enjoy this video. I'm gonna see you guys next one. Keep it easy.